New Pharisees. You cleanse the outside of a cup and the dish, and then you eat and drink food that goes into a body that inside is full of greed and wickedness. You fools! Did not he who made the outside make the inside also? But give as alms those things that are within, and behold, everything is clean for you. Are you saying giving alms is more important than being ritually I'm clean? I'm saying that your obsession with what is clean and unclean goes farther than God intended and does no good for anybody but yourself. We tithe everything so the poor can benefit, down to the smallest plants grown in our gardens. And to that I say, woe to you Pharisees! You tithe mint and dill and cumin, measuring carefully the last speck while neglecting what is actually important of the law. Justice and mercy and faithfulness. You blind guides, straining out an act while swallowing a camel. Look at these people. What have you done to help them? We have taught them how to observe God's perfect law. What you actively defy and break and encourage others to deviate from it. All of you, this man is dangerous. He's leading you astray. His words bring hope and healing. His words are blasphemous, heretical. And I say woe to you, Pharisees, rude. for you love the best seat in the synagogues and greetings in the marketplaces. Take it back. Right now, you can't hear insulting words. Oh, I am just getting started. <laughs> <laughs>